Hey guys, my name's Nadine and I want to invite you to come with us to have your mind blown in Dubai. So we are going to Dubai, May 22nd through 26th. Some of us may choose to go, go on the 21st. Some may choose to stay until the 27th. You have options. So this is what we want to share, what it includes so that you see it spelled out very clearly. You get a half day city tour of Dubai, includes entrance fees, bottled waters, guide and transportation. You get a half day Dow boat trip in the Dubai Marina, includes dinner, guide and transportation. You get a full day Hatta tour with desert safari, mountain safari and kayaking, includes dinner, guide and transportation. You get a half day nighttime city tour of Dubai, includes dinner, guide and transportation. Welcome reception with drinks and snacks, a private check-in, daily breakfast and three dinners, city taxes, host and round trip air trip port transfers. That is a whole lot of turn your brain off and just show up and be treated like you are on a champagne lifestyle on the bare budget. You notice the highlights of all the meals that are included, which is really nice to have that in there. Platinum inclusions are platinum members. Get an exclusive ticket to the Burj Khalifa to use on day four of the trip. From at the top observation deck on level 124, you get to see the panoramic view of the city from the tallest skyscraper in the world. Titanium. You also get all the platinum benefits, but you also get your very own butler service that will meet you right at the gate as you exit the plane. How cool is that? Here's the hotel we're staying at. Pretty luxurious. It's the Pullman Dubai Janeiro Lakes Towers. Beautiful hotel lounge, uh, the restaurant where you have breakfast each morning, amazing. Rooms are just impeccable. The spa is to die for. Here's your prices. Option one, four nights and five days, May 22nd through 26th, which is Friday through Tuesday. It's $799 per person which totals $1,598 minus 375 points, which brings you to a grand total of only $1,223 total for all that I showed you with your points uh, for two people. So that's only $611 per person total, includes everything that I mentioned there. Now, if you're a single person with points, it's only $644 for one person, which is a great deal for singles. We don't usually have that great of a bonus for a single person who wants their own room. So that's awesome. Option two is if you want to add a post night or a pre night, it will go five nights and six days. So you could choose either May 21st through 26th, which is a Thursday through Tuesday, or you can choose Friday through Wednesday and you would add 186.60 total for one pre-night or one post-night. That will total for two people would be $1,409.60, which comes to only $704.80 per person. Fantastic deal. Option three is what we are doing, six days and seven nights. We figure if we're gonna fly all the way to uh, Dubai, we want to stay a whole week. So we're gonna stay six nights, seven days, and May 21st through 27th, a Thursday through the following Wednesday. Add 186.20 two times for both pre-night and post-night, you get $1,596.20 with points for two, that's only 798.10 per person. Wow, <laughs> that's pretty awesome. So here's an alternative option. You may book the extra pre-night and post-night on your Dream Trip Awards site and save a little bit of money. Um, you want to make sure that you have the exact same 
quality room. So even though it says $65 a night and $72 a night for those two dates that are on there, that's for the very basic room. The Dream Trips room is a deluxe room. And as you go through here, I'll show you on a video coming up exactly what the prices are. But remember, prices fluctuate on the reward site according to the market. So these prices may not always be available. So you're always safe doing a post night and pre night on the actual Dream Trips booking. But if you really, really, really want to have that choice to save a little bit more money, you could definitely do it this way too. Also, private round trip airport transfers are not included in the pre and post nights that are not booked on the original Dream Trip. So if you book them on the original Dream Trip, then yes, your round trip transfers are included. But if you book them on the reward site, they may not be included. Uh, however, the hotel does have a free airport shuttle. It's just not that private uh, VIP type transfer. So I'm gonna show you a video that tells you exactly how to book it. And then we want you to go to the following site, book now. And Mr. Campbell wants to know if you're coming join us we don't want you to be left out don't be that guy who stays at home and paints the house instead of seeing the world we want you to be with us you should be here hey guys at this point i want to show you exactly how to go ahead and book your trip what you want to do first of all is go to your dreamtrips.com site you want to log in okay once you're logged in you want to go ahead to the first box and put in Dubai. Go down to the very bottom one that just says Dubai, click on it, and click on search. You will scroll all the way down to the one that we are going on. Uh, this middle one right here, it says City, Mountain, and Desert Delights in Dubai, May 22nd through 26th, $799 per person, 375 points come off at the end. So what you want to do is you can scroll down, you can see more about the trip, what's included that we already went over, but there's more in here. It's actually three dinners on there, I don't know why it says two, but there are three round trip airport transfers. So your airport codes, a section right here where you'll want to click on this right here to submit your flight details. Titanium inclusions, platinum inclusions, itinerary, everything you need to know. So you could just turn your brain off and just go on the trip. Hotel details the address, and any additional information that you need. So once you've gone through all that, and uh, you've read all that you want to, just click on select, and you will get to the point where you can book the trip. Now this is the cool part. It isn't always this way, but if you are a single person, and you just want to do one room and one adult, uh, we found uh, that after applying the points, you can get this trip for only $644. Uh, that's not always the case when a single person books a room. Lots of the rooms are uh, based on double occupancy. So after you subtract your points, it's only 644. So that's a really, really great bonus. So let's go back and start here. Uh, double occupancy, one room, two adults. Check availability. So normally it would be $1,598, but you're going to subtract your Dream Trip points. And if you have Rovia Bucks, you can subtract those. If you choose to add nights, you're gonna to wanna to do it at this point. Okay, maybe you wanna do a pre-night and a post-night. Click on apply. It will bring you a new price. 197120. Of course, you're not going to pay that. You're going to take your points off of that. And um, then you're going to press continue. Okay, you're going to now go through your checkout page. 
And on your checkout page, let's say you're just booking the four days and five nights and maybe you want to do the uh, Dream Trips Rewards platform for the um, extra, the pre-night and the post-night, right? So uh, maybe you'll just do this here and book the Dream Trip Rewards separately. Uh, go ahead and put in your names, name of the second person, birth dates, go down here. Your, okay, so the price you saw is $15.98, okay? Uh, 375 points you can reduce. If you have some Robia Bucks, I have 529 Robia Bucks, so it'll take that off. The only thing I'm putting on my credit card total for two people is $693.44, that's pretty cool. But if I wasn't going to use my Robia Bucks, um, whoops, I would, be putting $12.23 on my card. That's still a great deal. That's $6.11.50 per person. So there you go. That's how you book it online. Uh, if you want to go over to your reward site and book the pre-night and post-night, you can do that too. It's entirely your choice. Uh, definitely contact your upline or me or anyone if you have any questions and we'll help you get booked. So uh, Dubai, just remember when you book in here, you want to make sure you are doing the same room. You want to make sure that you're doing the same room upgrade. Okay, because a dream trip does have a nice upgraded room. So you don't want to downgrade a room just because you're going to the reward site. You want to do apples to apples. So I'm going to go ahead and put in here Pullman. Jumeirah Lake Towers, submit. There it is. Okay, what we have is a deluxe room. So we have we have this room on the dream trip. Okay, so, so if you wanna stay in the same room, don't book these, go to the one that says uh, deluxe room, breakfast included, if you want it to be included and go ahead and book your pre-night. Then you want to go back to the rewards site, to the main page, and put in the 26th to 27th for your post night. Now realize again that on the rewards site, the prices can always fluctuate. So the safety of doing your pre-night and post night on the actual Dream Trips booking ensures that you have it locked in at that rate and they can't change it because they've already signed a contract with it but at least you know that rate will never change so that's pretty cool here again i'm gonna put in pullman there it is select room again you don't want to do the lowest price room that you see on there you want to go with the exact comparable one on the dream trip so you don't have to switch around. Deluxe room, breakfast included, unless you don't want breakfast included, but uh, 127, and then you will finish your booking here. So there you go.